I was recently telling a friend about a project that I did in film school. The, the basic criteria of the project were that you produce a short film that you could not use any of the audio that was actually captured with the camera. You could add music, you could add sound effects, but you couldn't add dialogue, anything like that. And you had to convey a narrative. It had to be obvious to the person watching what was going on without dialogue. So mine came together at the very, very last minute. I almost forgot about it. And then the evening before it was due, I realized it, grabbed a camera, ran around to all of my dear, dear friends and begged them to quickly be in this short film. And I think it came out pretty cool. It was basically about a guy who was um, so into zombie films that he um, drove everybody on his hall absolutely crazy. Um, and then finally them exacting their revenge on him may or may not be auto autobiographical. Regardless, um, she asked if I had it on my channel. She said she wanted to see it. And I said, well, no, I don't. Um, and that got me thinking about where that project might actually exist because most people who know me know that I have a rigorous data backup protocol that not only do I back up my data in triplicate on separate drives, but I also have offsite backups in the event of house fire, whatever. Regardless, um, it wasn't always that way. The reason that I'm so crazy about my data is right after college, I had massive hard drive failure. I had all of my data on one external hard drive, um, aside from what existed on the laptop itself. So the only remnant of Roommate of the Living Dead is DVD. There were DVD copies of it that existed before I lost all the data. Um, that's not an ideal format, but regardless, after doing a little DVD ripping, a little finagling with handbrake, conversion from .iso to .ifo, I was able to, uh, to acquire Roommate of the Living Dead in glorious MP4. Um, there's some compression obviously from the settings that were used back in 2005 to get this on DVD. So the quality is taking a hit, but it exists nonetheless. I was able to actually pull it off of this and now it is backed up in my hard drive array and is safely nestled in a drive offsite. So moral of the story is you can trust your friends to help you throw together a movie at the last second and always, always, always back up your data. Anyway, let's watch it, shall we?
And there it was. Roommate of the Living Dead. Uh, definitely a blast from the past on that one. Um, I have a few other projects from within a couple year span of then, earlier than that and after that, that I'd like to try to resurrect and bring back from my sort of data graveyard. Uh, regardless, if I do, I may toss them up here. I hope everybody enjoyed that one, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.